The devotional writer for today is Glenn Packiam, and the reading is titled, No Longer Yourself. In the summer of 1859, Charles Blondine became the first person to cross Niagara Falls on a tightrope, something he would go on to do hundreds of times. Once, he did it with his manager, Harry Colcord, on his back. Blondine gave Colcord these instructions. Look up, Harry. You are no longer Colcord. You are Blondine. If I sway, sway with me. Do not attempt to do any balancing yourself. If you do, we will both go to our death. Paul, in essence, said to the Galatian believers, You can't walk the line of living a life that is pleasing to God apart from faith in Christ. But here's the good news. You don't have to. No amount of attempting to earn our way to God will ever cut it. So, are we passive in our salvation? No. Our invitation is to cling to Christ. Clinging to Jesus means putting to death an old, independent way of living. It's as if we ourselves have died, yet we go on living. But as Paul says in Galatians 2.20, the life we now live in the body, we live by faith in the Son of God who loved us and gave himself for us. Where are we trying to walk the tightrope today? God hasn't called us to walk on the rope to him. He's called us to cling to him and walk this life with him.